Next up we have Max the Brave by Ed Veer. And again, there's a little black kitty. It reminded me of my black cat, Wilson. Max the Brave. This is Max. Doesn't Max look sweet? Max looks so sweet that sometimes people dress him up with bows. How's he feeling about that? Max does not like being dressed up with bows. Now let me tell you something. I have a five month old, Mackenzie. Um, I'm always seeing people dress up their little baby girls in these beautiful bows. And if I try and put a bow on her, she will scream like cannot stand bows. So that's another personal connection. Max doesn't like bows. Mackenzie does not like bows. Because Max is a fearless kitten. Max is a brave kitten. Max is a kitten who chases mice. Gonna have him standing tall wearing a cape like a superhero. Max the Brave just needs to find out what a mouse looks like, and then he will chase it. Huh, maybe mouse is in there. Max bravely explores the can. Mouse, are you in there? Hmm, maybe mouse isn't here. Oh, hello. What did he see? Little fly. The fly is just going zzzz. Are you mouse? No, I'm fly, says fly. But I just saw mouse scurry by a moment ago. Hmm, maybe this is what mouse looks like. Did he find mouse? No. Excuse me, please, but are you mouse? I'm not mouse, I'm fish, says fish. But I just saw mouse dash outside. So Max just keeps missing mouse. That must be mouse up in the tree. Excuse me, please, but are you mouse? We are not mouse. We are birds, say the birds. But we did just see mouse scoot by. He always seems to be just a couple steps behind mouse. Excuse me, but would you happen to be mouse? Eek! Mouse? I'm not mouse. I'm elephant, says elephant. But I did just see Mouse skitter by. Thank you very much, says Max. And you? Nope, that away. Ooh, who did he find? He found Mouse. Hello there. Are you Mouse by any chance? Who, me? No, certainly not. I'm monster, squeaks Mouse. But I did just see Mouse asleep over there. What is going on? Is Mouse telling the truth? No, he's tricking Cat. Why? Yeah, because he doesn't want to be chased. If you're very quick, you might catch him. Thank you very much, says Max. Hmm. Oh, what's asleep there? A big monster. This must be Mouse. Hmm. I didn't know Mouse was so big. <clears throat> Excuse me, Mouse. Will you wake up, please? I am Max the Brave, and I have come to chase you. You think this is going to go over well? Wakey, wakey, Mouse, yells Max as he bounces up and down on Monster's head. I am Max the Brave, and I chase mice, and I might just eat you up, too. Oh, Max. Uh, hmm. I didn't know Mouse 
had such big teeth. Can you guys make a prediction? Can you guess what's going to happen next? So Max is standing right on the edge of Monster's mouth. And this whole time he thinks that Monster is a mouse. What do you think the monster is going to do? Because the monster is awake. I don't think he's very happy. So can you say, I predict that, and then tell what you think is going to happen? I predict that monster is going to eat Max or bite him or definitely chase him. <gasps> Go! Oh. Gulp. What happened? Where is Max? If you said that Max is in the monster's belly, you are right. But how do we know that? The author didn't say the monster ate him. How can we tell? Yeah, because you make the sound gulp when you eat. And also, it's pitch black now. It's real dark. We could see Max's eyes. So we know, we can infer that Max is inside the monster's tummy. Uh, uh, oh, whew, thank goodness he sneezed. And out came Max. Yuck! Max decides that chasing mice is not all it's cracked up to be. And anyway, he doesn't need to be Max the Brave all the time unless he's out chasing monsters yeah. so the mouse tricks max and makes him think that he is a monster and the monster is a mouse but it doesn't really matter in the end because max realizes he wants nothing to do with what he thinks is a mouse but is actually monster he still wants to chase the tiny little mouse that goes by monster. So that was Max the Brave by Ed Veer. Can you guys think of a time that you have been brave? Go ahead and share that with somebody in your family.